Hello and welcome, my name is Menturis and let's do another speedrun at my time Porsche and let's get another achievement. This time we are going for the Relic Explorer achievements. Discover a mysterious room in an abandoned ruin. So, as the achievements already said, we need to go in an abandoned ruin and we need to find a mysterious room that is somewhere on the bottom of the ruin. Saying all that room and rune is getting me all confused. So we're in the rune and as you can see I have already been mining here so the most effective way is to go in the shaft you've already been mining the ore out. Then the fun part starts. You need to press the F button if you got the default key bindings. And you need to find the yellow dots. Try and find the most effective way. So look around on the map because you need to go all around the bottom floor of the rune to find the purple dot. Don't be shy to also mine a little bit ore doesn't hurt and you need your anyway so here we hit rock bottom this gray layer is the bottom floor of the rune and if you hit that then you know you're at the lowest point you're gonna get in the game mining all these dot will get you a lot of stuff so when you jump in the runes don't forget to empty your backpack because you're going to need the space a lot Sometimes you find metal stuff inside a wall that looks like a room, but it's not. At this moment I thought I found a room and uh, yeah, I was digging around it to search for a door. But that's not how this thing works. So if you find this type of metal or something else, because I found different types of these things, it's not the mysterious room. Keep looking at the yellow dots and once you find a purple dot, that's where you need to go. At this moment I have already dug out every yellow dot in this map and then I realized I was doing something pretty wrong. And that was that I shouldn't been in the second rune. If you want to find a mysterious room, you need to be in the first rune. And that's the most important thing. I got a lot of stuff out of this rune. But if you want a relic floor achievement, you need to go to the other rune. And I guess I slowly realized this at this point. Because there were no yellow dots left. And I did clean out a lot of space. It took me almost one day and if you can see my stamina bar is pretty low. At this moment my stamina was pretty low and the day was almost over. So going into the first rune wasn't any option. And so we went home for a good night of sleep. You need a lot of stamina to do this achievement. So here we are at the first rune and day has passed. So let's jump right in it. In this rune I have already digging a lot of uh, tunnels. So there are many yellow dots left. But we have still a few to go. So this will take a lot of time and a lot of stamina. If you're smart you should get some food that boosts your stamina because I was pretty low at not getting this achievement in the next day and I already wasted one day doing this so all the ore that I got was some reward but not the best reward as I wanted the achievement. So digging to these last tunnels getting a lot of stuff 
My stamina is pretty low at the moment. Lucky I got a little bit of food and there it is. The purple dot. It's kind of hard to see it and see the difference because the yellow and the purple are kind of look alike but the ring around it clearly state it's different than the yellow one so here's my biggest problem I need food I need stamina at least I need the stamina food and I don't have that many stuff on me only got some apples and let's hope this is enough for me to get to the room because I don't want to sleep another night over this achievement it's costing me a lot of time and it shouldn't have because this achievement is pretty easy to get if you know which room you need to get and here we are you just press the E button and you're in the mysterious room and you get the achievement there are a lot of sofas in this area so that's pretty nice but besides the sofas it's nothing special some small boxes and that's kind of it so you go to this place for the achievement and not for the stuff that's in it because that's not much. I hope you guys enjoyed this achievement hunt and if you'd like to see some more tell me in the comment down below. Also if you're new to this channel push the subscribe button, push the like button, I really appreciate that. So if you are searching for any other achievement runs I've already done the Master Cross, Cat Lover and a lot of other achievements so check out the other achievements that are coming on your screen right now or check out my total playlist or push the subscribe button at the end of this video and if you want any help with any achievement of any game leave it in the comment down below I would really like to hear a challenge and I will try and do my best getting that achievement and making good video instruction for you See you at the next speedrun of my time in Porsche.